I'm Brian College, and in my spare time, I fish Northwest UK waters in search of a double figure carp. Spending hours on the bankside, striving to get you the best fishing content. I'll bring you fishing with my family and with my friends and also with the mighty chat. <laughs> Oh, oh. Do you like that? Yeah, welcome to Aquatic College. Well, good morning, welcome to Aquatic College. My name is Bry, and today is not a Mighty Chad competition, it's a social event. So we're here today at Brookside Fisheries. We're on Meadow Lake, and we've got a special guest. So we've had Sarah Taylor, who's a Fishermania champion. She's been watching my videos, and she's seen how bad Chad is at fishing. So she's decided to come along today, have a bit of a fish, and give Chad some lessons. So we're gonna be here till about, I'd say about two o'clock. Two-ish, two, half past two, until Chad catches a fish, and uh, I'll send you some footage. So keep on watching, and uh, hopefully we'll get some fish, and Chad catches one. I'll see you in a bit. So in this special edition competition, it's going to be the usual point system. For a double figure carp, we get four points. For a carp over five pounds, we get three points. For a carp under five pounds we get two points and it's also two points for the biggest carp. Now meadow is normally really prolific for bites so hopefully we're going to catch loads of fish. So let's see how the day pans out. So let's go and see the first competitor and it's the boss lady. Good morning. Good morning. How are you today? I'm fine, I'm fine. Yeah, and you're on the left hand peg? Yeah, the only problem is I can't see the bank. No, we can't, we, neither of us can, can we? Chuck and chance, I think I'm the other island, but uh, we'll see. I'm, I'm really pleased, I'm, I've been casting out, I've not actually hit the bank yet. Not yet, no. Give it time. <laughs> it's a lovely, lovely day. It's beautiful, considering it was chucking it down last night. So we're having a little comp, but not a comp. No, a mini comp. Just a day one. Just a day one. Bit of a laugh. Yeah. See, oh. see how many Sarah can beat us back. Yeah. <laughs> we'll get to Sarah in a minute. <laughs> yeah, it's Let's... a lovely day. Expecting the best. Yes. When well, I can see. Yeah, well, good luck. And you. And uh, hopefully we'll see you with a fish. Hopefully. Or two. I'll let you know, I'll shout you. Yes, if you can see me for the sun. Yeah. And then we'll go over and we'll go and see the mighty Chad who's behind that tree. Yeah, he's hiding, he's lonely. He's lonely, we'll go and see Chad next. He's
So the second competitor is the mighty Chad. Do you know you'll be giving me an after that? <laughs> Good morning, how are you doing? Good morning, how are you? How are you? Is your heart okay? I'm fine, thank you. Just keeping much. you awake. Is what? Just keeping you awake I'm while waiting for bites. Oh, it's away. And where are you casted? Sorry? Where are you casted? I'm not as far as up to the island. Over there? Yeah, I did a bad cast. So did you? I'm just... It's normal, that, isn't it? About two thirds of the way out. Oh, nice. Well, I want to get near the island next cast. Here? Yeah. yeah. Can't get to that tree there, because the... Why? Because I'm bloody bit. Oh, yeah, this one's a bit... Yeah. You could maybe just, from here, if you stood up and flicked it, you could probably get to it. Oh, yeah, you could you could get it through this angle and then sit back down. Yeah. Oh well. I'll try that. I'd, I'd try it. I'd try it. It's off the tree. That's where I was getting them. Yeah. I'll try it. Oh. Right, well. if, stuck in the tree. if you get stuck in I'll the tree, it. I'll film it. We can have a mighty Chad uh, have the master class, right. can't we? How yeah, to we'll cast? Have a master class, shall we? And welcome to the Mighty Chad's Masterclass. Today we're going to be looking at how to cast between bushes and get it up against a tree. Right, what I'm going to do now, I'm going to show you uh -huh. the right way of casting and uh -huh. the wrong way of casting. Don't show the wrong way, we've not got time for the wrong way. No, with the right way. Just show the right way. I'm going to do the right way, I'm not going to do the wrong way. Okay. If you want to go under the tree then, if it's in front of you, uh -huh. what you do? So we want to avoid this tree we here, avoid this tree and here. we want to get to that tree there, yeah. okay? So you get close to this tree. Uh huh. Just knock your pellets over. Knock your pellets all over. Okay. You can get there, can't Yeah, you can, yeah. Well. Right, this is the right way of casting, but I can't see because of the top. Mm-hmm. And there's no line on there. Right. One. Way. That's perfect, that Chad. Now that is the right way. To That's cast the right it. way to cast. Not the yeah, wrong way. surprisingly. I haven't got time to do a show with the wrong way. But okay. That is the right way. You're okay. And I've got to spill all my pellets. Are you ground baiting baiting in the margin? Are you? Eh? You ground baiting in the margin. <laughs> well done, Chad. Thank you very much, boy. Do you want me to go in and throw you some pellets off that corner? No, no, I'll do it. No, I'll, okay. I'll I want to pick these up first. Okay. Oh no, I can reach there. Can you? Okay. Yeah. Well, good luck. I'll leave you to uh, pick all my stuff up. Pick all your stuff up. That'll do. Well, good luck, Chad. Thank you very much, Lee. And then we'll save the best to last. Bring your party. We'll go and see Sarah. Good morning. Good morning. How are you today? I'm alright, how are you? I'm good. Yeah. Can't wait for the lessons today. <laughs> and we have Paul the cheerleader at the side. Hi. Hello. Good morning. So what's today's plan? Try and catch some fishes. Try and beat Chad is the plan. Try and beat Chad? Yeah, just it's just not gonna be difficult. Right. <laughs> yeah. And where you cast the two off the island? This way off the island just because that water level's gone down a bit. Yeah. Find a little bit more depth of water. Reef off that island. We've got a shallow line I'm feeding out there. And then I've got a little edge down here. I'm feeding for the ground breaking corn. Now shallow is just four mil pallet. Nice. Just, uh, just giving myself some options really. Trying to catch some fishies. Right. And you're feeding in the middle as well for that's shallow, yeah. So just feeding like right Nine meters, maybe. Mm. Just get some feeding, bring them up at the bottom. Fishy, shall I? Nice. Well, well it's beautiful, beautiful weather. Nice day. Nice and sunny. I can't see where I'm casting, but. <laughs> well, I'd say good luck, but you don't need it, so. Hopefully, I'll see you in a bit with a few fish. Yeah, good luck. Chad's still picking up pellets. Mm. 
Well, the morning went really slow. We had a lot of rain last night, and I think that's cooled the water a lot and put the fish off. I found that when we had lots of rain, the fish stopped feeding. So no matter where we were casting to, what bait we were using, we were just not getting bites. Surely four of us can't blank. Well, yeah, we could. Well, she's taken her time. But finally, she's got one. Well, I'm going to get across this mud puddle here. Stick some mud. We're relying on Sarah for content, and luckily, proper fishing, Chad. I see well. Hard fighting. Nice. Yep, yeah, don't lose it. Nice. It's a nice win. Yeah. Very nice. Nice. So this is Sarah's common carp and it's turned out at 6.8 pounds, which gives her three points and also two points for the biggest fish. So it's now 10 to, 10 to 11 and uh, hopefully the bites will keep on coming. Apparently Chad's in, so I'm racing around thinking. Oh, well done. That was just on the tree here. Yeah. Not where you No? It's not that big. Well, it, it's not going to be the biggest fish. It might be, fa is it over five pounds? Yeah. No. No? I don't know. Well, they sell, they say carp are like the people who catch them. And this funny shaped carp hey. is 4.8 pounds. We'll keep still, which gives Chad two points. Well, not long after Chad got that carp, it was my turn. Fish took it from the island, went over to the right, managed to control it, and was just bringing it in and I already had the speech in my head of finally catching a fish. Not in yet. And then it happened. I 
mean, out on blast. Come on. Absolutely gutted. Well, it's 20 to 2. Still not had a fish. But whilst I've reeled in, I thought I'd show you what I'm using. So I am using an 8mm cell pellet, and that's on a size 12 hook. And then I've got an 8 pound hook length, and that's through to a 24 gram method feeder. And on there I've got poloni mix, sweet corn, chilli hemp, and a bit of krill sauce. And then that's through to my Camo Tech mainline. So this is what I've not had a fish on all day. I've blanked, so I'm going to put it back in and hopefully in the next hour I'm going to try and get a fish. <sighs> Pretty funny. Well, Sarah's rescuing the day again with another fish. Nice. Very nice that one. Oh hey. Yeah, because you're ugly. Nice that Sarah. Yeah, I'd nice say about fish. three pounds you reckon? Yeah, probably about three, yeah. three and a half. Yeah. So that's another two points. Well done. Well, unfortunately, that fish that Sarah caught was the last fish of the competition. So the final scores were Sarah's got seven points, Chad's got two points, and me and Carol are both on zero. I'm determined not to blank for the day, so I'm going to stay on for a couple of hours and hopefully catch some fish. In the meantime, I'm going to watch the true fishing masterclass of Sarah Taylor. Well, the match is over, but Sarah's keep on catching. Nice. Cracking that, cracking, very nice. A nice common. Well done. Show me how it's done. Well, Chad's going to be fuming because Sarah's casting over to where Chad was on the island and she's got two fish in about five minutes. Oh.
No. I can't even dive. I'm having that much water. <laughs> Oh, really nice. Finally. I think that's bigger than your last one, isn't it? Uh, yeah, it's probably the last one, yeah. It's not the game for the day, though. Nice. That's a nice fish. Well, now Sarah and Paul have gone, and I'm staying on for an hour because I'm determined not to blank. Well, this is my second chance to redeem myself. I was concentrating so hard making sure I got it in the net and then the hook pulled absolutely devastated sometimes you've just got to come to the realisation it's just one of those days no matter what I was going to do I wasn't going to catch a fish. I didn't mind sitting there as the sun was setting. I'd really enjoyed the day, even though I'd not caught. I was just desperate not to blank. I just wanted one more chance so I can do an outro holding a fish. Just want to catch a fish. I'm going to give up. Well, Chad and Carol have gone. Even Sarah and Paul have gone. And they've left me on my own to try and catch a fish. Unfortunately, I lost another one at the net. And. I've ended up blanking. It was a really good day. Really enjoyed Sarah fishing. Learned absolutely loads from her. So I really do appreciate Sarah and Paul coming down and fishing with us for the day. So as always, so thanks for watching. Please like and subscribe. If you'd like to leave any comments in the comments section, I'll answer them all. And hopefully I'll see you all soon with some carp. Thanks for watching.